All right, I'm on. Okay, so what's going on, beautiful people? Tomorrow I head on a road trip. Where to Vegas? For how long? I don't know. Uh, going to be staying in a hotel for three days and then camping for three days and then uh, a hotel for three days again. So that's all I have planned. Um, end destination, I don't want to say yet. We will find out sooner than later. Um, but in terms of information, that's all I know so far. So we're going to roll with it, see what happens. See how it goes. Uh, you guys can tune in each day. I'll do like a little short clip video, whatever you want to call it. Um, and all I can provide you is like low to mediocre entertainment value. That's all I can promise. But it will begin tomorrow. Wish me luck. See you soon. All right, so just finishing up back up. And anyways, I'll, I'll let this video speak for itself. But uh, I think I might have a little uh, part on crime. Hi. Hey. <laughs> you want to come? Want to come on the road trip? It's nice because you're a light packer. You don't. You're only taking the ball. Nothing else. All right. Looks like you're ready. Let's do it. All right. It's twelve fourteen. Ironically, it's my birthday. Not sure what that's to do with anything, but uh, about to head out. And once again, little one is trying to sneak in. Rest your head on that. <laughs> so, just getting ready to head out, and uh, it's lunchtime. So, keep that real quick. I know. Um, I will leave that today. So, we're uh, 10 minutes later. Basically, done with lunch. About to head out. I guess I don't have to update you every 10 minutes, but All right guys, I'm getting on the road officially Road trip 2021, definite road trip Here we go Here we go So I can't make this shit up, man um, About three minutes on the road Check engine light comes on some of my bags and the zipper came off can't make this shit up anyways we're here got my uh... all right and for all you guys that need proof done all right so I just checked in the room simple I'll do room check bathroom shower bath King bed, simple. View, not the strip, not on the backside, but she'll do. She will do. There it is, folks. There it is. Night numero uno. There we go. All right, guys. So that was my official day one in the books wrapped. Uh, really, uh, again, I appreciate you guys tuning in and checking that out. And... Um, yeah, I'm gonna go take a shower and then I might head back down. Uh, I'm gonna explore a little bit. I might pop it on a movie. Not sure, uh, but I hope you guys have a great night and uh, let's crush tomorrow. For those of you who don't know me, and I know everybody here most likely does, but if you don't, my name is Brad Scripps and I really appreciate you. And we will talk soon. Good night, peace, love, and harmony. I never said harmony before. Hey guys, so I thought I was done for the night. I thought I signed out, but. Twist and turn. We got a really wet spot here on the carpet, so I'm changing rooms. Um, I'm going to go set my suitcase down there, and uh, it's just completely damp. So I kind of see like right there, it's really wet. That's all. Completely soaked. See that water coming up right there? Push down. And it's really cool if you watch me feel this. Long story short, we might have to redo that rating system I just gave you in bed, so things change. 
All right, guys, just got to my new room. Uh, much better view. It's kind of a semi-strip with the uh, Vader Stadium. I'll show you that in a second. Just want to share a quick horror story I had in Vegas about four or five years ago. I was staying at the Wynn with my girlfriend at the time, and we had a two-night stay there. It was awesome. It was great. For those of you not familiar with the strip or familiar with Vegas or Wynn or whatever, Wynn is an easy top three property in the entire strip. It's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, the point of the story, though, is we want to stay an extra night. The one was sold out. But we ended up staying at... Uh, the stratosphere known as the strat now which does sound like the rat which is honestly the worst movie brand of all time that's another story we get up to the room she's in the shower she shrieks i run in there she was um there's a pair of dirty underwear in the shower so i hop on the call right away hang on for 45 minutes never get through i go down to the front desk myself talk to the gm um, he does nothing i repeat that he did nothing not, I would have never stayed at that property again, even if he did do something, but I would have had a little bit of better taste in my mouth and maybe commended the hospitality or, or whatever the case was. He did nothing, so I will never stay at that property again. I will never speak highly of that property, and not that there was really much to even speak highly of in the first place. So, long story short, this was not a horror story, that was a horror story. And um, what Ari did, I called down the front desk, Super, super nice. She changed it right away and then offered me $75 food and beverage credit on top of what I already had. So kudos to you, Aria. Thank you.